Hello guys! As a part of my soldering station building video series, you may notice in my previous video that I built a film extractor. And in today's video, as a continuation, we will build a popsicle stick handled soldering iron. Here's the things that we need. Battery or unit 12 volt supply, popsicle sticks, DC to DC converter, and for me, I have tried the boost converter for heat adjustment function for quick heating, terminal block, soldering wire, soldering iron tip, pliers, glue gun, soldering iron, and screwdriver. Hey guys, if you're new to my channel, please support me by clicking that great subscribe button and that notification bell for you to know when I have a new video and you can also watch my previous videos. The building process starts by removing the metal connector of the terminal block. We'll use this as a holder for our soldering tip. We need two of these connectors for the negative terminal and the positive and we position it like this you have to make sure that the two terminal connector have a gap and not touching each other and each screw will connect to the terminal of the soldering tip In building the handle, we will use the glue gun. We will stick the popsicle stick to the connector. Make sure not to put excess hot glue to the soldering iron tip because you will lose the easy tip change functionality. And to add more strength, I have poured a lot of hot glue at the other end of the handle and cover it again with popsicle stick. And after that, if you want to heat up in just a second in red hot, like me, you may use a boost converter, but even if 12 volt only, it will do the job. So to connect the boost converter, you have to connect the battery to the input side of the boost converter and the DIY soldering iron to the output side. Make sure to adjust the voltage not to exceed 20 volts because it will stress up the tip and it will break down easily.
So, that's how turning this into this. Soldering iron that you can adjust the heat can be powered with battery. And not just that, depending on what you're soldering, you can easily change the tip. Please support me by clicking that great subscribe button and that notification bell for you to know when I have a new video. And you can also watch my previous videos. And if you have any suggestion improving the design, please feel free to comment, like, share, and build. Thank you for watching. See you next time.